Welcome to my review of Jurassic Park. <laughs> yes, that is right, ladies and gentlemen. I have started my journey with the Jurassic Park and Jurassic World franchise. This is going to be a five-week project leading up to Jurassic World Dominion. And this morning, on a very soggy Tuesday, <laughs> I'm going to bring you my thoughts of one of my all-time favorite movies growing up. 1993's Jurassic Park. Now, this movie was everything growing up for me. And uh, I loved every minute of this. I've probably seen this movie well over a hundred times. And it's a straight creature feature action adventure. And it's about uh, this eccentric billionaire that like invites a couple people to his island. And he uh, wants to have them endorse it. And, uh, huh. there are real dinosaurs on this island. And you know what happens when you have, like, real-life dinosaurs against humans. Humans aren't gonna survive very long. And, uh, this is a really, really fun movie. I mean, it's a classic, directed by Steven Spielberg, of course. And this is celebrating its 29th year. And it still holds up today with the animatronics and uh, near-perfect CGI. I would say that uh, the best part of this entire movie is the cast. I mean, you have Sam Neill playing Dr. Alan Grant. You have Laura Dern playing Ellie Sattler. And you have Jeff Goldblum playing Ian Malcolm. Sir David Attenborough playing John Hammond. And, of course, uh, Joe Mazzello as Tim. And Ariana Richards as Lex. And... I gotta say that this is probably one of my favorite movies growing up, like I said. <laughs> but, uh, there are some very intense moments in this film. The one that stands out, of course, is the raptor in the kitchen scene. I mean, or on my toes when I watch it, because it's almost directed like a horror movie. <laughs> Where you have like uh, the masked killer looking for his victims. But they're two velociraptors. I just love this movie very much. And it is a perfect movie. And I have nothing bad to say about it. And uh, that is what I want to talk about on Jurassic Park. <laughs> it's not a lot because I've seen it quite a few times, but just wanted to give a, a brief review. So that's what I think about Jurassic Park, and I would give it an A+. If you haven't watched Jurassic Park or the franchise, I definitely recommend watching this one. Because it is probably the best. So, those are my thoughts on the classic Jurassic Park. Huh. And that wraps up my first individual review of this franchise. Next week, I'm going to bring you the Lost World Jurassic Park. So... I'll see you guys really, really soon. 
And uh, I'm hoping to watch the first Doctor Strange here in the next uh, day or two. And I might uh, film a review for that too. Leading up to Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Which I will definitely see Friday. And I will have a review up for that very soon as well. But I also have The Lost World, of course, coming up. Then I'm going to do a, a first watch of the original Firestarter and uh, talk about that. And then the remake of Firestarter. So, very exciting stuff coming up. Just stay tuned and enjoy Jurassic Park. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Adios.